have no doubt that the issue that every person wants to hear um, is uh, concerning um, Shore, Omoloye Shore. We have issued statements in the last weeks, and uh, the statements were unambiguous. They were straight, they were direct, they were plain. And at all times, we were explaining our stand on issues. That he was granted um, bail by the court, yes, we said we received the court order. Now, every legislative enactment and the judicial pronouncement needs to be enforced. Legislative enact uh, enactments, judicial pronouncements are usually enforced. And that is why there are law enforcement agencies operatives. The idea is that, you know, when these laws are made, they are also enforced. If Shore was granted bail, and uh, we said, and he was in our custody, and we said, yes, you have been granted bail. Now, do we bring Shore at the gate and ask him to go? Is it a discharge of responsibility that we do that? What if Shore was going on the road and he was knocked down by a car? We said, people who should take Shore through proper documentation had not come. And they didn't come. And up till now, they didn't. Rather, what some experienced persons, people who ordinarily should be respected, came out to say was that uh, some people came and they didn't see us. And uh, we said this and we said that. That is not true. Miscreants, protesters, and uh, some people who were not parties, unqualified, to stand and document properly and take responsibility that Shore had been released to them, did not come. Or those were the kind of persons we saw. So they were not the appropriate persons. And by every level of conscience, by every argument of good conscience, and I ask you, fellow Nigerians and press people, is it the right thing for those kind of persons for us to have released Shore to a mob? People who came and acted unruly and were fighting and forcing themselves into the facility. And that brings us to the issue of using gun on them. No, no gun was used on any person.